Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel for a fantastic video about a fantastic little independent video game developer guys, a German independent video game developer, German just like me guys and uh, yeah they are fantastic, fantastic company guys, they are known as NG Dev Team now I have covered their games on my channel before but I've never put something together like this, guys. What we're going to do is we're going to take a look at three of their titles. Now, they are brilliant. They were founded back in 2001 by two brothers. And they are known as Tim and Rennie Hellwig. So, yeah, fantastic. Two-man team founded this company, guys. And they've done some stellar titles. And what they specialise in is putting games onto old hardware, guys, like the Neo Geo. And the Dreamcast, guys, this is just flaming brilliant. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at two games that are on the Dreamcast, guys. So, newer games for old hardware. Oh, I love it when this happens, guys. I love it. And then the third one we're going to look at, guys, is they branched out. They went to the Nintendo Switch as well. Again, I've covered this game before. I even had Josh do a play on with me. And it is Gunlord, guys. Gunlord X. Now, originally it was released, again, onto the Dreamcast as just Gunlord, but as soon as they hit the switch, guys, they change it up, and in this case, it was Gunlord X. Now, the reason I'm doing this, guys, is because there's a new game coming to the Nintendo Switch. Now, it was delayed. It was originally going to be released on the 21st of June, but now it's been delayed, guys, and it's being released on the 19th of this month, guys, so it's imminently coming. Now, it's going to cost you just under 18 quid, guys, for this gem. But I'll tell you what, it's worth every freaking penny if you go buy any of their other games, guys. It's worth every penny. Now, this has also made an appearance on the Dreamcast in the past, but I haven't got that version. So, we're just going to look at two Dreamcast ones, and then we'll look at the Switch Gunlord X, guys. So, what is the new game called, you ask? I hear, yeah, I can hear somebody asking, what is that new game called? Well, guys, it is called... Uh, Raisna EX, yeah, Raisna EX. I think that's how you pronounce it, guys. I'm looking down here, Razzina, well, Razzina EX. There we go. We'll stick with that, Razzina EX. So, yeah, fantastic. Can't wait to get my hands on that. Oh, it's going to be stellar, guys. Absolutely stellar. Um, but, yeah, would you like to join me as we take a look at this developer, guys, and just what they're capable of? Because they are fantastic. So, we'll start with. The brilliant, the wonderful, Last Hope Pink Bullets, guys, from 2009 on the Dreamcast. Then we'll move on to Neo XYX from 2013 on the Dreamcast. And then we'll end the video looking again at Gunlord X, guys, from 2019. What a wide berth there, guys. Wicked. Absolutely wicked. Wide berth on time. And this will be actually their new game that's coming, guys. It's going to be their fourth shoot em up. So wicked. Absolutely wicked. You know how much I love shoot em ups. Ooh. Right. Shall we get on with it and have a look at this fantastic developer, guys? Right. Back in a sec, guys. Right, here we go, guys. With as little talking as possible. I promise. Yeah, Pink Bullet's Last Hope, guys. What a fantastic game from 2009 for the Dreamcast, guys, by the German developer, guys, Dev Team. Wow. Right, here we go. So we've got Start Game, How to Play, High Score and Options. Obviously, we're going to go to Start Game. It's very uh, <laughs> surprising that you have to avoid these pink bullets. You'd think, oh, they're pink, they must be pickups, but they're not, I can assure you.
Watch out for these little people at the bottom as well, they will try and shoot you. Get out of the way of that one. Ooh, they got me. Oh, you bugger. Guys, with the second one. Right, here we go guys, with Neo X Wax. Right, so here's your options guys. So you've got start game, controls, and a screen stroke sound. So we're just going to go start game. Here's your controls guys, it tells you all about it. Right, interesting. 
Right, here we go then, let's play this thing. Watch out for those pink bullets again, guys. Oh, I'm dead early. How fantastic is this thing, guys? Eh? How fantastic. Oh, yeah, I keep dying. How awesome is this guy? Warning! Again. Oh, yeah, bugger. Oh, Yes, we're going. Wicked. Ah, run out of time. But what a fantastic game, guys, eh? That needed a longer play on. Wow. Brilliant. done it before guys but we've got to have another look this is after all team dev video 
in anticipation for the new game to hit the switch guys listen to that music it's glorious absolutely fantastic and what a game guys what a game again all three of these are stunners all right let's play it shall we there you go, game start, controls, sound, screen, accomplishment. Obviously, like I said earlier guys, it is on the Dreamcast as well, but I thought we'd look at the definitive version of this game. I know I've shown it before guys, but it has to be here. Wow. There we go, guys. Right, here we go guys, you might remember this from the last video, but wow, is this a brilliant game.
Ho Oh dear, well that was a fantastic look guys, what a way to wrap this fantastic bloody nibber. Developers video up guys, brilliant. Right, back in a sec, to my final thoughts. Well if that doesn't wet your whistle for the new game guys, I don't know what will. 
I mean, they are stellar, aren't they? They are fantastic. And, you know, even on the Switch, guys, I mean, obviously they've got more, um, what shall we say, more current hardware to work with there, haven't they? But they still look so retro at the same time, guys. It's just fantastic. I mean, Gunlord X is beautiful on the Dreamcast already. Or Gunlord is beautiful on the Dreamcast already. But Gunlord X just takes it up that notch in a way. Yeah, absolutely awesome that these games are around, guys, and that they've been made for old hardware and now also on the Switch, guys. Now, they've always said, this development team, that if people buy more of the downloads, yeah, they will produce more physical, because it is physical available, guys, but only limited edition, and they go for a fortune now, guys, because they sold out a long time ago, a lot of the earlier ones. Now, they will make more, as long as people are buying the actual downloads to give them some money to produce them in the first place of physical so yeah that's something to to look forward to if we you know make plenty of purchases on the downloads there will be more physical coming guys and how wonderful that would be so i personally can't wait for the new game to hit the switch guys the uh rasneon <laughs> rasneon uh, ex however you pronounce it um, yeah, it's going to be wonderful, guys. So I can't wait. Very soon, isn't it? The 19th, guys. It's literally just spitting distance. So, yeah, you can grab yourself it for just under 18 quid, guys. So what a stellar little German independent developer, guys. They are fantastic. Oh, and I know Josh loves their games as well. He's played all the ones that we've got currently. And uh, he loves them as well. So, wow. They appeal to the younger generation as well. As always, all farts out there so yeah guys there you go a look at this brilliant development team guys of ng dev team wow and with that guys i'm going to say the usual if you're not subbed already please drop me a sub give me a bummy thumbs up if you feel that way inclined and of course tap the bell icon and the all icon to get any future notifications and guys do you love old classics i mean that's what these look like don't they all classics guys do you love them because it's a fantastic way of playing them, and that is through emulation. And if you do love emulation, whether it's handheld or home system plugged into your TV, I've got a brilliant group for you on Facebook, guys. It's the Retro Emulation Fan Group that me and my bestie Nate set up some time ago. We now have a fantastic admin team behind us as well. Tons of videos, whether it's system reviews, emulation performance, tech help videos, or just tons and tons of content, guys. So if you love emulation, come and have a banter with the admin team and the members, guys. It is linked below. Head over and come and join us. And then, guys, I also have my UK Kraut Gaming Facebook group as well, which is covering everything from retro to modern gaming, guys. So from Pong machines to PS5s and everything in between. Again, tons of videos go up there every single day because other YouTubers are putting their videos there as well, which is fantastic. But it gives you loads of content to be getting on with and watching. And again, guys, fantastic member group, fantastic admin team. Just come and have a banter about anything to do with gaming. Again, linked below, guys. And finally, I have a Patreon. Another video there for you to watch, guys. Linked below again. If you head over there, give it a watch. And then, uh, yeah, you'll see why I set it up in the first place, guys, as I explain myself. And with that, <laughs> I'm going to love you and leave you. And I'm going to say, I'll be the same. Cheers and goodbye. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.